All right, before we go out to dinner, uh, we're going to make this video. This may be a completely separate video. Maybe be part of the vlog. I don't know. But what we're doing is showing you that you can hook up a DVD player or Blu-ray player to your television. So we do have here a movie. Um, I think it's playing the trailers at the beginning. But <clears throat> what it is is my wife follows all of the, the uh, blogs and, and stuff on Facebook and stuff like that. And people Cruise ask, Critic. Cruise, Cruise Critic also. Cruise Critic. People ask, can you bring a DVD player onto Carnival Cruise? And she will answer yes, and people will say no. And they'll tell her, no, you can't, or if you do, they'll take it. This is our seventh cruise. We've had one on every single cruise. This time it is hooked up with an HDMI cable. Um, and that just goes right here. All you need to do is find on the back of the TV where the HDMI cable connects, just like you would on your TV, and then it is no problem to connect a DVD player. I know people get a lot of hate for doing that, but if this is my vacation and I want to watch a movie before I go to bed, you got little kids who want to watch cartoons or whatever, why not? It's yeah. your vacation. Do what you want to do on your own vacation, man. For real. Most cruises, we've always used the three auxiliary cables, the red, white, and yellow. On one cruise, I won't lie, we did hook it up and we couldn't get color, so we watched a black and white TV the whole time. But every other cruise, we've always been able to get color. This is the first time we've used the HDMI. So, there you go. You can switch back and forth between the DVD player and the um, selection of wonderful television that you get that comes on the cruise, you know, but whatever. So, um, it is possible we do do it. We watch TV. See, pause, play. We watch movies at the end of the night before we go to sleep. So, if you have kids or whatever, there you go, man. It works.